Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. Badenstein! Vital intervention. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Terrific block. Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. Trying to deliver it accurately. Still not clear. Takes the shot. And she's hit it with power. Just wide, however. Well, no surprise there. Spain have had most of the possession, but it's been a frustrating performance from them so far. They just haven't had enough guile in the final third. It's all been a bit too predictable, which has to change. Can she put it away? And a decent save. Full credit. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Being egged on by the crowd. A goal to give them a 1-0 lead. An excellent value for that advantage, you've got to say. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect, and the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top quality goal. Oh, big chance! Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect. And what an easy finish it is in the end. Mind you, the market is so poor. She didn't even need to jump. She won't care about that, though. In with a chance. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And when through on goal, she makes no mistake. She just hits it so cleanly and with power. That's a great finish. Crossing possibilities. Opportunity! And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here we see it again, and you have to say the build-up play was brilliant. Quick one-touch passing, clever movement, and a simple finish. That was a really good team goal.
Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, her volley was close. High degree of difficulty. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but she's caught it well. Very unfortunate. Delivering it. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Now, potential danger. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. A glut of goals. The whistle is sounded, and a place for Spain confirmed in the last four. Well, the result was never in doubt, was it? They controlled the game from start to finish, they created numerous chances, and they dictated the tempo. A very comfortable win for them in the end.